welcome back to my channel. It's me, Giselle. And if you're new, welcome. I'm so glad you clicked on this video. We're going to be doing an unboxing of the new items I got from Shea Moisture. Like, I'm so scared with this hair and this candle behind me. Like, I'm going to just blow it out. Make sure you subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any videos from this lovely face. So, just to get into the items we got, we received seven, three, yeah, seven items from Shea Moisture. And just in case you guys do not know, or if you're new to my channel, I am a Shea Bassador. So basically, that means every two months I receive products from Shea Moisture, blah, 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 Shea Moisture to review and demo for you guys. And um, even though I'm an uh, ambassador for Shea Moisture, I give my honest opinions. I'm going to leave the links to the other couple of videos that I've done for them. This is the first beauty box that we received. The first item we have is the Ocean Glass Mineral Eye Eyeshadow Palette. And it is six shades. And we it is a range from neutrals to... I would call this neutral and a couple of pops of color in there. I'll have some swatches pictures up here right here. And we also received an eyeliner pencil and this is the dang it, let me find it. This is just the eyeliner pencil in gold. For eyes, we got the mascara and this is the ultra control and define mascara in the shade black and I've already used this mascara because I ran out of my other one but I am in love with this wand I love wands like this that are like ultra small well the wand is thick but the bristles are really really small and that's to, just to grab every lash that you have so I'm excited about this mascara Next thing that we received is the Illuminating Mineral Bronzer in Cinnamon. So this is just a pretty bronzer for the face. Especially if you want to achieve that summer glow. That's all I've been loving for the summer. Next we received a blush and this is the Peach Coral Mineral Blush. And this is okay. We'll see how it shows up on my cheeks. I think it might be just a tad bit too light for me, but we'll see. Next we got is the Mineral Shade Glow, and this is in Sparkling Rose. I'm guessing this is a highlighter. Okay, so it's coming off more white on camera with all my lights, but it's a champagne gold color. Oh my goodness, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Okay, we are going to be glowing to the gods and everybody and their mamas is going to see our glow. Okay, and then we have a couple of lippies. So the first one we received is the uh, lipstick in Sarah. And this is just a jumbo lip pencil. And you just twist the bottom to get more product out. And this is just a really pink like a true little pink color it's pretty we received a another lipstick this is their shea butter um, luscious lip gloss i'm sorry luscious lipstick line and this is in the shade nectar and this is like a true a true peach color it's so creamy and it is great i'm probably going to use this with like a lip liner we're going to see which one i want to use start off with the eyes i'm just going to go ahead and conceal under my eyes really quick and put some powder under there um just in case there's any fallout i want to go ahead and catch that now that i got the powder under my face or under my eye i have the colors right here so you can see which one i'm going into i'm just going to take my bh cosmetics brush and this is just a blending brush and we are going to take the shade uh, after Lily and this is just this um, I would just call it a like a brown like brownish color and I'm just gonna use this as my transition color really 
you don't know what kind of look I'm going for, I'm just just going. I just wish this had a mirror. Like this would be bomb if it had a mirror. So now I have to like use it like this just to use my big mirror from my um, Goods palette from Color Relations. Like I love this mirror on this palette. It's wide. I can see both of my eyes so I can see what I'm doing. <sighs> so that's a negative. This palette doesn't have a mirror so it's travel friendly but not travel friendly. Um, I kind of just want to keep it like neutral on the top. So from my color Elations palette, and this is in the nudes, I'm going to take this brown and put that in my crease just to darken it up just a little bit. So next I'm going to take my Morphe M502 brush just to blend everything out and make sure it's just seamless together. And if you guys do not have this brush in your collection, you are really missing out. It just blends everything so flawlessly and smoothly. Like, I don't know where I've been in my makeup game without this brush. I'm pretty happy with the eyes. And there's just a, well, there hasn't been a lot of fallout really. So on my wet, flat, BH Cosmetics brush, I'm just going to go in the shade Golden Nugget and I am just going to place that all over my lid. Ooh, that's pretty. That's really pretty. On the other eye, I'm going to do a little bit something different. I'm going to go in with that gold and put it down as a base to see if it pops more. Oh, that is pigmented. So I'm going to put this on top too. And then I'm just going to put some more shimmer shade on top of that. I'm going to go back in with Golden Nugget and just layer it on top. I think this is what I needed to make it pop a little bit more. This is pretty. I'm not mad at it. Let's sweep that powder from under our eye because we don't need it no more. So we're going to use that gold eyeliner and put it on our bottom lash line. Oh, my eyes always waters when I do this. I'm just going to take that dark brown on a flat e.l.f. This is the eyeliner brush from e.l.f. And I'm just going to put that brown on the outer portions of my eye just to connect it a little bit. I decided not to put on lashes just so we can see the true form um, or the true performance of how this mascara works. I really like this formula. It's very lengthening. The wand separates my lashes really nicely but I feel like the wand is too thick, like the body of it is just way too big so I'm like really scared to get close to my lashes, like to the base of my lashes because I feel like I will mess up and like jab my eye out. I like the design, the bristles on the, wall, on the wand as well as the formula. I really like the formula. Okay, so for the bronzer, like I said, this is this uh, Mineralize Bond Bronzer in Cinnamon. And I'm just going to take a Wet n Wild angled eyeshadow brush to apply this. I think this is a little bit too light for me. Maybe it's just, I don't know, my eyes and the... Wow, this is dusty. This kicks off a lot of dust. A lot of kickback. Okay, 
So for bronzer, you're just going to um, put it all over your face like you would for a contour. It's just to give some color back to your face. It's a little bit, you can see it a teensy weensy, weensy 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 bit on me. It's, it's pretty, it's nice. It's not my shade, I think it's a little bit too light for me. I would just want it a tad bit darker. Yeah, I would just want it a tad bit darker. But I ain't mad at it. Yeah, for blush, and then we'll go to highlighting. So for blush, this is the, um, again, the Coral Peach Blush. And I'm just taking my BH Cosmetics blush brush. So yay, I'm actually using a blush brush for blush. Who would have thought? So we're just going to pick that up, tap it off. Oh, okay. This is nice and subtle on my skin tone. So you just want it just like a, a kiss of blush. Second to last but not least, the highlighter. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay, so again, this is the Rose Sparkling Sparkling Rose Mineral Shade Glow. And, ooh, okay. Light it up. Yeah. Yes, fam. This is what, this is what I came for. Gotta hit that nose. Look at that nose! Ooh! Oh my goodness. Bro, this is gonna be like my new highlighter for the rest of the summer. I am not mad at it at all. Yes! I want Jesus to see me with this highlight. I want him to know that's that's my servant Giselle down there beaming to the gods. Yes. I am. I'm just going in with the Jumbo Limp Pencil in Sarah. What's that song? It's like an old song. I want you to come and smile for me, Sarah. I hope that's the name. Ain't it Sarah? Mm -hmm. This smells like a crayon, like a literal crayon. So if you like this look, make sure you give it a thumbs up. So out of everything, I was really, really surprised with the blush. I don't even know if you can um, see it on camera. I really like the blush. I didn't think I was going to like that. You know, this highlighter is what I am living for and it's probably going to be my new favorite for the rest of the summer. And um, everything else was a go besides the bronzer. I think the bronzer was a little bit too dark, I mean, a little bit too light for me. I really can't see that, you know, real good glowy bronze look that I want from a bronzer. So I just think the shade was a little bit too light for me. But the formula and everything on it was good. So if you are a little bit lighter than me, then that cinnamon bronzer probably would be best for you. And I really like the mascara. I just don't like how thick the wand is on it. So that's a bummer for me. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel to see everything else that I put out for you guys. Make sure you hit the bell notification to be notified each time I upload, which is Sundays and Wednesdays at 7 a.m. Central Standard Time, if you are wondering. And I'll see you next time. Bye.